the World Vision W5 and the Lattice Gaming Houses Network Free by Stars is proud to introduce the main event of the evening in Zagreb. Here we go, ladies Five and gentlemen. Five round bout for the European title in the weight category of 85 kilograms. The referee in the ring is Denis Sidenko. Denis Sidenko will be refereeing in the ring the last fight. We got Mladen Kranjic from Croatia, I Jan Landa from the Czech Republic, and Igor Schmidt from Slovakia, who will be our side judges. We will be introducing the blue corner first. Confidence is the main thing which a true champion needs to possess among many others. You should believe in your lucky star and feel that you keep moving the right way. The way of a champion. Nobody but you could distinguish what to do to achieve your aim. You'll become successful only if you carry out your plans boldly. Uncertainty is your enemy. Faith in their own strength is the distinctive feature of people who climb to the top. Be confident. Be brave. Make the only right choice to be yourself. Welcome to the W5 and Rebuy Star Show in Zagreb. Fortune favors the brave. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to invite to the blue corner. Please welcome to the ring, Bogdan Nastasi. Bogdan, the shepherd, Nastasi. He is 22 years old, 179 centimeters. He has 35 fights, 30 wins, eight by KO and only five losses. Experienced fighter for a young fighter. I'm 
Mă așa că trebuie să sară Dă-le să sară Dă-le noapte de arat Și pe tot de București Dă-le să sară Dă-le să sară Dă perversă de craiova serios Că nu vă fac ca să știe tu și tu Și cine este la prova Și nu faci tot ce faci Să faci și să faci bine Nu te dai în spate nici cu plons după tine Din sărăcie rea mai rău nu o să fie Ai simțit ce ai trăit? Ești la crem și nebunie Și nu-i lăsat că vor să-ți ia Tot ce-a mai rămas drag în inima ta E chiar așa cu sau fără motiv ori intenționat sau nu, dă-le nu doar instinct Că nu suntem dar de cap, dar avem capul tare Și nu suntem doar vagabuți, o dăm tare Tu ai vrut de când ai crescut Să răspințești făcut A venit momentul să știi Oare cât de tare poți fi Ladies and gentlemen I'm going to invite to the red car. Please welcome to the rain Akron, Brett Tenney. Here comes Agron. He is 25 years old, still young, 182 centimeters. So he does have a three centimeter height advantage. We'll see if that plays any part in this fight. He's got 23 fights, 19 wins, five by KO, three losses and one draw. Looks like an evenly matched fight between two warriors. Again, Agron did win by a KO two weeks ago in the W5 Vienna fight. This is for the first Europe W5 European series that we are offering. We have another one coming up in Slovakia in two weeks. We definitely want to check out that one as part of our European series. This is for the European title in 85 kilograms. Remember, it is five rounds. It is three minutes per round. There is no twisting. There is no throwing. There are no elbows. You are allowed, if you clinch, to throw one punch or one knee. Uh, there is no extra round in this fight. It is a 10-point scoring system. Winner gets 10 points. Loser gets nine or less. And now we just have to wait and see what happens. I'm very excited to see this fight. I've seen... Agron fight before, he's a strong fighter. Very powerful, very powerful fighter. We're gonna take a moment now to introduce the fighters officially in the ring and then we'll be playing the national anthem and then we'll be on our way. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the fighter in the blue corner. 22 years old, 179 centimeters. His professional record is 35 fights, 30 wins, 8 victories by an account, and only 5 losses. The representative of Romania, Bogdan Sheffield! No. And so this is the fighter in the red corner. 25 years old, 182 centimeters. His professional record is 23 fights, 19 wins, 5 victories by an account, 3 losses, and only one true. The representative of Croatia, Akron! Ladies and gentlemen, Anthem Sounding Romania.
ladies and gentlemen, anthem sounding Croatia. <laughs> So the time for talk is over. The time for fight is we are here. Now ready Ladies for and our final fight for the championship. For new emotions, it's W W W five time fighters. Please the center on three. Hey friends, listen to my comment. W5 rules, no clinch, no wrestling, no elbows. I won't see you, I won't see good fight. Good luck, gentlemen. There we go, they got their instructions. We're now gonna get the okay from the rest of the judges and our first round will be underway. The judges look like they're ready. Everybody's out of the ring. This should turn out to be an amazing fight between two very experienced, strong kickboxers. The first round. Bogdan already thrown those left jabs. Just quickly sneaking through the defensive Agron. Agron follows up with a nice kick to the hip. Got a strong right leg, Agron does. And a good, strong defense. Already three times he's gone to that hip. Good defense by both fighters right now. Oh, a nice left kick to the midsection of Bogdan. Nice pop. Good left-right combination by Bogdan. Agron follows up with his own counter combination. Agron definitely loving that right hit. Going after it quite a bit. Get him high up on the leg. There it is again. Bogdan looks like he's just like, you know, I don't even feel it. My legs are numb. Going after that left leg of Bogdan, maybe he knows something the rest of us don't. But Bogdan, whatever it is, says he's okay with it. Oh, a nice big right by Agron. Bogdan got that left jab in. Oh, nice left knee. My Agron brought it up. Bogdan just blocked it in time. Big right hand by Bogdan, by Agron. Good left jab. See the head of Bogdan's, or his head snap. Agron using a lot more of his legs here in the first round than his punches. Good left jab by Agron. Again, going after the side, the rib section. Bogdan. Bogdan having none of it, though. Having none of it. Oh! A big left kick. Just nailed Bogdan on the side of the head. 
and he didn't even bat an eye. If I were Ag, I'd be like, wow. I just gave him a great kick and it didn't even, he didn't even budge. End of the first round, that was a powerful left kick to the head. And Bogdan took it with full force and smiled at him. See what comes out here in the second round. Agron, I think, dominated that first round. Going after the legs in the midsection with his kicks. He landed a lot more. Bogdan did get a couple good hits in. But I think Agron won that round. There you see that left kick to the midsection. Nice, cool, quick combination. Not much power, but still that'll wear your opponent down. And there's that big left kick to the head. You can see the difference in the amount of uh, punches and kicks thrown. 18 total for a Bogdan versus 40 for Agron. Bogdan comes out straight away throwing those punches. He's going to have to get more aggressive. He's got a nice left hook. Oh! Two big lefts and an uppercut, right uppercut by Bogdan, all landing. Agron smiles at him as well, and he's like, you know what? You hit me, I hit you. Neither of us feel it. Let's just go to battle. Bogdan coming out a lot more aggressive, throwing those combinations, going to the boxing. We'll see if he uses his legs a little bit more. Oh, a big right uppercut by Agron. Very strong fighters. Bogdan with his own left uppercut landing. Two very strong chins so far. Agron getting that right hook through the gloves. Nice body shot. Bogdan counters. Good start to the second round. Very even so far. Some big punches being thrown already. Agron keeping with his game plan, going after that right, that left leg of Bogdan. Again, he goes after it. Oh, big left hook by Agron, but Bogdan doesn't even phase by that hit. This is amazing. Some big hits both fighters have taken, and they're not even phased, not even a step back. It's like they don't even feel it. Big kick to the midsection again by Agron. There's a good knee by Agron. Just catching Bogdan on the bottom of the chin. Another low kick. Really working that left leg. Minute left here in the second round. Big left hook by Agron. I seriously think that Bogdan doesn't feel anything when he gets punched. Nothing facing him at this point. Agron's giving him some good pops. Oh, big right uppercut by Agron. You see that head snapping back, and there's just nothing going on between him. Five round fight. Already in the second round, we've seen some big hits, some big kicks. Nothing's affecting either of these fighters at this point. We'll see what happens by the fifth round, if it goes that far. But I tell you, this is a battle in the making. I was thinking that left jab through. Quick snap. Ten seconds here in the second round. Uh, Agron going there with that right leg kick to the head, just missing. That is the end of the second round. That's a battle. We've got a battle on our hands, people. You don't want to go anywhere because the excitement is just beginning. Beautiful, beautiful second round. I think both fighters equally delivered the punches and the kicks to each other. You see what kind of effect those uh, low kicks are ha gonna have on the left leg of Bogdan later in the later round, maybe from the third to fourth. There you see a good left jab by Bogdan sneaking through the, the defense of Agron.
Fighter. Gogan coming out again aggressively. He's done it every round so far, throwing the first punch. Agron going with that left leg mix section again. Using his legs very well, Agron is. A lot of kicks and wear down his opponent. Weaken that left leg. Ah, oh, left, right, left by Agron. All oh, landing, both that, not even feeling it again. I tell you, this man's got a steel chin. Two quick jabs, both landing on Bogdan's face. So far, nothing has affected this man. A left, right, two hooks. And again, Bogdan just stands there. Any other man would have been phased or dazed by now. Very strong fighter, Bogdan. Agron really giving him some good pops. Oh, a big right jab by Agron. Bogdan just smiles at him and says, bring it. I will say that Bogdan's defense is really weak, and Igron just throwing those jabs and is going right through the gloves and landing on the face. Nice right uppercut followed by left hook by, Bo by Igron. Bogdan counters. So far, the tempo is in Igron's favor, that's for sure. Good combination. That left hook snuck past the defense of Bogdan. I think Bogdan's beginning to start to feel those kicks and those punches because he's definitely slowed down his aggression. He's not as active. This round is definitely favoring Agron. He's throwing more, he's landing more. Oh, nice right hook by Bogdan. A minute left here in the third round. Good left-right hook combination by Bogdan. Oh, a big right leg by Agron. He stuck Bogdan. And now he's throwing the combination. Bogdan might go down. No, he's not. Oh, big uppercut. A right hook, left hook combo. But Bogdan just standing there smiling, saying, you can't phase me. I can't believe he's still staying after the combinations he took. Another big right hook, a left uppercut. He's swinging wildly. He's got nothing left, but he won't fall over people. Look at this, Agron just nailing him, but he won't go down. He's got a last and he clinches. Oh, Agron missing his opportunity. Bogdan, what a chin on this man. He is a warrior as well. Fierce, takes a beating, but look at him. He just doesn't topple over. Left, right, jabs, everything is landing at this point. Another left hook by Bogdan. He can't even throw anything. He's got to protect himself so he doesn't go down. I think Agron should be frustrated right now and just ask himself, dude, why don't you fall over? End of the third round, a very powerful round for Agron. We've got our first stun of the night. But look at both down the corner, he's out of three bodies. It's like, man, I think I screwed up that round. I'll get it back, don't worry. Agron is just giving all his energy, but he can't take Bogdan down. We'll see if that daze will affect his performance now here as we go into the fourth round. If he's more cautious, I think one good connection by Agron and Bogdan might just finally fall over. A knockdown by either one of these is gonna tilt the fight into their favor. It's more evenly matched. I got Agron myself two rounds to one, or at least two rounds and a draw in the second. Bogdan is behind, in my opinion, almost 100%. He's gonna have to do something. He's gonna come out aggressive. There's that big right kick that stunned him. And just watch as Agron has his way with him for the rest of the round. That big right uppercut, left hook, right hook, everything landing. It doesn't matter how powerful it is at that point once you're dazed, even the lightest thing can topple you over. But Bogdan's not afraid. He's bringing the fight again in this round. He comes with his own combination. Throws his combination, quickly covers up. Smart move, he's got to keep that defense up. It looks like Agron's strategy of wearing that leg down, kicking him in the midsection, bringing his defense, finally paid off in the third round. And he goes straight back to him. He says, fine, put your defense up. I'm just going to keep kicking you till you bring it back down and open yourself up for another big punch. Good left jab by Agron. Powerful punter. Now, now the head's starting to snap back by Bogdan. Now he's starting to feel every kick and punch. If he wants it to stop, he's gonna have to be aggressive and he's gonna have to tag Agron very soon. 
Otherwise, he's not going to take much more. Too cautious. He's playing the cautious fight now, which is fine. But he's going to have to do something because Agron looks fresh. He looks fresh. He looks energized. Bogdan looking a little tired. And it's just going to get worse as the round and the fight goes on. He needs a big one if he wants to change the tide of this fight and get it even again. Oh, big right uppercut, a left hook by Agron. But Bogdan not phased by that one. Agron just having his way. Everything he's throwing is landing. Big right hand by Agron. Bogdan definitely playing the cautious. He's in retreat mode. Agron just taking his time with him. In my opinion, now this is Agron's fight to lose. Big right uppercut again, just missing. There's that left jab. Bogdan is feeling now everything. You can see it. He's beginning to feel every punch and every kick. Super That's going to be the go here in the four, uh, fourth round. And Agron, I'm going to give him this round as well. He's the one being the aggressor here. He's throwing the punches and the kicks. Getting that left jab, landing again. Bogdan doing very little now in the ring. Evenly matched fight. Just right now, it is all Agron. Good left by Bogdan. He needs something bigger though. Agron got all the confidence, all the tempo, completely controlling this fight. Bogdan needs a big punch or a big kick. He hasn't used his feet pretty much at all tonight. Nothing major, hasn't gone to the head. Agron mixing it up great. Good evenly mix up of his punches and his kicks. We're in the fifth and final round here for the W5 European Championship at Rebuy Stars Casino in Zagreb, Croatia, and it is for the man out of split Croatia, Agram Preteni, to lose this fight. He just gotta, in my opinion now, he's just gotta take his time, keep, keep Bogdan at a distance, get a couple punches in, even if you draw this round. He already won three of the five rounds, three of the four rounds so far. He's controlled the tempo, he's the aggressor, who definitely weighs heavily with the judges. It's important. Bogdan's in retreat mode. He was definitely tagged by that kick in the, the kick to the head in the third round. And since then, he has been extremely cautious and not as aggressive and not being able to land any of his bigger punches. A lot less power. You can tell he's winning. And obviously in the fifth round now, he's a lot weaker in terms of conditioning. Who wouldn't be? Here is the fifth and final round. Bogdan again comes out, throws the first punch. He needs to get, he needs to get Agron in a corner and just start unloading on him. Agron's still landing those punches. Everything is getting through the defense. Oh, a big right by Agron. Bogdan has got a chin of steel. Agron landing an uppercut. Nothing right now is affecting Bogdan. This guy is amazing. Oh, big right jab. Big right jab by Agron. And again. I could see him handling one, two, three. But he's taking 10, 12, 15 punches like this. A big right by Agron. Oh, nice left kick to the midsection. Cam Bogdan turned the tide of this fight. With two minutes left, he's got to do something. Time is not on his side. Look at that. Even with his defense, he can't stop the punches from getting through. Agron really having his way with him. That knee landed. Bogdan is exhausted. At this point now, it looks like he's just trying to get to this fight. He has no power, no pop. His speed is down. He needs a confidence booster. Good, technically sound punches and kick by Agron right there. All blocked, all blocked by 
by Bodong. But he's still quick, he's still fast, and he's got the power. He's doing a great job of protecting his face. He wants to get out of this fight. He's got a minute left, and he wins the fight. He's doing a really good job of throwing his punches and kick and making sure, look how tight his gloves are. He doesn't want anything getting through. And that's one thing Bogdan failed to do today. He's been face failed to weaken Agron's defense. But Agron definitely, with those kicks over and over again, he got Bogdan to bring his arms down. And that was the big difference in this fight. Oh, a nice big left kick again that landed. He's got Bogdan in the corner. He just landed a left hook. Another right to the chin of Bogdan. A left. Agron's got him, another right hook. He's got him in the corner. He just, oh, big left uppercut. A left combination, right combination hook. Bogdan's not going down. The man is just standing there taking it. What a chin. Lesser men have fallen for a lesser. Bogdan's exhausted, 15 seconds. I don't want to see a knockdown now. I want this man, even if he loses, to say, you know, you gave me everything, and nothing could take me to the mat. Look at this, he's just taking a beating. That is the fight. Agron's gonna win by unanimous decision in my eyes. He won every round except maybe the second round. And he will be crowned the W5 European Champion here in Zagreb, Croatia tonight with three by stars and W5. Let's see what the judges say. President of Manel Arts Cathedra in Kinesiology Faculty in the University of Zagreb. Humbling houses, Rebuy stars, Vladimir Chaska, great fight owner. between two great warriors. And, and I will say w that Bogdan Chipinoga Nastasi, Prison. what a chin. Look at these shots, uppercut, left uppercut. He's not, his eyes, not even once, other than that kick, did he look like he was about to go down. He has a chin of steel. What an animal. But in the end, Agron came in, he got him a week in his defense, he kept with those low kicks, he kept nailing him in the side, he had no choice, but Bogdan had no choice but to start protecting the area as he started hurting more and more, and that's when Agron went to town in the third round, and that is pretty much when it was over. He controlled the tempo the entire Ladies fight. And it was his gentlemen. fight to lose once the third the round bell ended. by a unanimous decision. The champion! Of Hero of Rebuy Stars, Agron Pretendi! Congratulations to Agron. I don't Fighter think it's a surprise to anybody. He deserved it. It was a good, hard, strong fight. And that is the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, that ends it for us here tonight at W5 Live Stream. I'm Dan Repco. I want to thank Three Ducks. I want to thank uh, Green Hill. I want to thank. Uh, who else do we got to thank? We got Sport FM. We have got Six, six Rental, Rent a Car, Supernova, and of course the place where we're hosting this event, Revi Stars. You can check them out at RevisStars.com. They are here in Zagreb, Croatia, and many other places. I want to give a big shout out to Sergei Chepanoga and Dmitry Ivanov. It was great, a great event you guys held. Thank you very much. A big shout out to the entire staff, to all the judges, and of course to our great ring announcer, LA Navision. I'm Dan Repko. I will see you guys in two weeks, June 18th in Slovakia. Make sure you order your package now and tune in. It's going to be a lot of fun. Very exciting. We'll be with Rebuy Stars again as part of the European tour. For now, I say goodbye. I'll see you in two weeks. Have a good night and thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Alana Hola, the champion by Double Five Rules. Good evening, everybody. I would like to congratulate to Agron if he's ready for the interview. Okay, we will hold a minute. Champion, I grow pretty near.
Let me congratulate you. Good fight. Thank you, Bogdan. Let me say thank you to Vladimir Chaska, to Rebuy Stars, for the nice place, the biggest gambling house. Welcome to Rebuy Stars. Thank you. Agron, hi. hi. Congratulations to your today victory. Two weeks ago, you, thank you. you won by knockout in Vienna. Yes. Today, you won again. What an incredible performance. How do you feel like a European champion of W5? Well, I feel great. I'm uh, satisfied that the belt is on me, so and I'm looking forward to defend it soon as possible. Well, I see. What was your tactic today? Because I saw you were coming with the boxing, you were coming for the low kicks, and after you were kicking to the head. Well, I know he's the fighter. He's a brawler. He goes in. He loves to fight. So tactic is to keep him on the distance, uh, break his leg, then finish him with the hands. It was doing good, but. I must thank to Bogdan. He took this fight only one week ago. So big applause for him, yes. please. Great. And and he gave me a very good uh, uh, pressure. You know, it was a good fight. He he was uh, he maybe wasn't too ready, but he gave his heart in this ring, and we all see it. And he made all five rounds. So it's uh, very congratulations to him too. Okay. Thank you, Agron. I wish you good luck. In your future career. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our grown Pretty, the champion of Europe of W5. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, many thanks to all the fighters, partners, and you, um, our friends, and um, our general sponsor, uh, Humbling Houses, Rabbi Stars, thank you so much. Thank you for being you. See you on the 18th of June in Prividza, Slovakia, on the next tournament, W5 European League, to the way of a champion. Bye.